Okay, um, this sand hut's just not working for me, and my reindeer antlers broke this morning. So, um. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing like a Christmas bake with me. Um, I'm currently filming, I don't know whether it's gone up yet, like which video is going up first. But I'm currently filming a get into the Christmas spirit with me. And one of the things I wanted to do was bake Christmas cookies. But I thought, why not just make it a whole video in itself? So that's what I'm going to be doing today. Um, I'm going to be using like the best of the best stuff. I'm using Aunt Cat's cookie dough with Betty Crocker icing. So like these cookies are going to be amazing and i was like i can't be bothered to make gingerbread cookies because that's so much more effort than i would like to put in um and so i have the cookie dough and to make them christmas i'm just gonna make them little gingerbread men and like some stars so that's my current go i did want to wear like a santa hat but like it's just it's not working so we're gonna go with that basically it's not really gonna be a tutorial because there is no tutorial i'm just gonna be talking with you so Let's get started. I think Aunt Cats is just an Australian thing, but um, I know in America you can get like six of cookie dough, but oh my goodness, like if you grew up in Australia, you would know that like you literally would grow up eating Aunt Cats cookie dough. I just remember like I've gone to, gone to a couple of sleepovers before and like you just eat sticks of cookie dough. Mm. Actually the best thing in the world. Okay, how am I gonna get this open? That's my question. So, other than the fact that they're going to be dressed, like, they're going to be shaped as gingerbread men, they're not really Christmas cookies. So, I brought some, um, it's so good, but so gross at the same time. Not gross as in tasting, please don't come at me. I mean, like, gross about the fact that I'm eating a stick of cookie dough, but I don't care. So, other than the fact that they're dressed as gingerbread men, well, like, shaped as gingerbread men, they aren't really going to be Christmas cookies. So, I thought that I would get some Betty Crocker icing and I might like dye it green. So it's the 20th today, like of December. And that is actually like the scariest thing ever. Like the fact that it is the 20th of December already, which means that Christmas is in like four days. I'm five days. I don't really know. I'm kind of, I'm on school holidays. I'm bad at math. I don't care. Like the fact that Christmas is so soon and then after Christmas is New Year's, like so straight after is actually terrifying we totally don't have a rolling pin okay i'll deal i'll be fine it's been like not gonna lie not the best year of my life but we survived it am i right and that's what really matters so hopefully 2019 will be a much better year okay these gingerbread men are massive this is so much harder than okay i have to Throw away the packaging and now I don't know how long to preheat the oven for. Close enough. Only like hundreds more to go. That's fine. So fine. But I've been so out of the Christmas spirit this year. Like it has been a joke. Like it's five days for Christmas and I'm only just starting to feel it. Like I don't know why, but I've just been out of it. I think because like I've had so much going on. I'm like I haven't really had that much going on. It's just like... I don't know, I just haven't really been film like feeling it. And then on top of that, I had so many Christmas videos I wanted to film and like I blinked. I swear I blinked and it was like December was almost over and Christmas had like happened. Well it hasn't happened yet. I don't know what I'm on about, but <laughs> I'm trying, okay. Okay, so I filled up the tray of cookies. Every gap has cookies, but I have like Heaps of leftover dough and I don't know what to do with it. And I can't eat anymore, I will actually vomit. Oh, it's so sensitive from Christmas, maybe. Okay, I genuinely could not fit another cookie on this plate unless I wanted it to all become one big cookie. So I'm gonna put them in the oven now, but ugh, I threw it away again. I don't know how long they're meant to be in for. Oh, whatever. I'll put on like a five minute timer. I'm sure that'll be fine. There we go. Put a timer on for like five minutes. Okay, I've got a timer on for five minutes. I'm gonna do some cleaning up and then I'm gonna start 
making the like dye, like the icing. So I'll be back once I've cleaned up and I'm making the icing. Okay, I'm gonna make the icing now, but I'm like so lazy. So, and Betty Crocker icing is like the best icing ever. So I just got the vanilla one and I think I'm just gonna put like food dye in it to make them Christmassy. So I'm just gonna do it. This is literally the best icing ever. If you've never had it, you like have to. Like it's not even an option. Okay, and then I'm gonna take, oh, I should have split this. Okay, now that my hands are green, I'm just gonna use the spoon. That one can go, this one can be green. See, it's so pretty. This spoon is way too big for this bowl, like way too big, but it's fine. I'm gonna take a different spoon for the red one. What? I just looked in the dishwasher for the cookies. These are the how the cookies look right now. I'm gonna leave them here to cool because I can't really do anything with them yet. But I'm gonna move them. No, we'll leave them here. They're pretty. I just know I'm gonna burn myself. Okay, I feel like the exposure is too low. I can't even see myself. But I have to wait like half an hour for the cookies to cool down before I can ice them. But I have one bowl of red icing and one bowl of green icing. So I'll be back in like half an hour probably. Hopefully. Unless I get kicked out of the kitchen. But okay. Okay, so I thought I'd be half an hour, but I ended up being like three hours because we ended up having people over. Um and so yeah, it's like much later now, which is why the lighting is completely different, but that's okay. Got the cookies out of the oven. They're like, they all got kind of stuck together. So when I peeled them apart, like some of them like lost a leg. Um, and I don't know what happened with that star, but other than that, they're pretty good. Um, I think I'm gonna do half of them green, half of them red. And like, I wish I'd been smart about this and brought like M&Ms or something and made them into like gingerbread men, but like I'm dumb and didn't think about that. So we're just gonna ice them. They're gonna look really dumb, but it's fine. I can't remember if you use a knife or a spoon to ice cookies. Don't wanna like run to you one first. This is gonna look terrible. Like honestly, um, don't know why I thought this would be a good idea, but whatever. They might look bad, but they taste good. It's not even like, it's just a ball. We'll call it a ball ball. It's that star, it just did not go well. Basically, after I turned off the camera, we had like this crazy thunderstorm. I'll put like a video in or something. Look at that. But oh my goodness, they're like, storm was crazy the hail was massive and it was so intense like it literally looked like snow not that i've ever seen snow but <laughs> it's what i imagined snow would look like and it was crazy and then like halfway it was the weirdest weather like halfway through the storm the sun came out and then as the sun came out we got like because we live like near the ocean this like massive rainbow like, Like almost double it just you can quite see the second one but you could see a little bit and you could see the full arch come up and out of the ocean it was insane and then it got sunny and now it's thunderstorming again and the weather is just being bipolar and i do not appreciate it like no it doesn't actually look that bad they're kind of cute i'm gonna lie i kind of like them i'm like in this weird mood because i was trying to edit a video um, and I thought it was gonna be like a good video and I was like really happy with how it was turning out And then I realized I hate it and it's a really dumb idea and I don't know what I'm doing with my life And I think most of the reason why I don't get lots of videos up is because the videos I film I end up just being like Ew, I hate this and deleting it. So I don't know what to do I don't know whether it's dumb or whether it's like all right, like it's kind of dumb, but like 
Will it be entertaining? I don't know. <sighs> Are you even supposed to ice cookies? You're so not supposed to. <laughs> so, I've finished my Christmas cookies. I have one plate of red slash pink cookies and one plate of greens cookies. It would have been cool if I could have decorated them in like, like men, but I didn't think that far ahead when I planned to do this. So, they're all right. Let's do a little taste test. Let's have a little red one. I'm going to feel so sick after this. Not bad. Cookie is 100%. I prefer making like big dough balls and then they like fun into like really doughy cookies, but it's so pretty good. But yeah, um, that completes this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I would highly recommend mostly just this. I would highly recommend this icing and uncast cookie dough, like 10 out of 10 for both of those. Um, but yeah, I will hopefully see you on my next video. And if I don't upload any more videos before Christmas, Merry Christmas. Um, I still can't believe how soon it is, but that is crazy. Um, Merry Christmas and hopefully I'll upload between Christmas and New Year, but if I don't, Happy New Year. And yeah, that's kind of it. I hope you enjoyed this video because I know I enjoyed making this video because I got to make myself cookies. But yeah, I love you all and I will hopefully see you on my next video. Love you guys. Bye.